National Five Biology students. Let's do these questions together. So question 19 says, the diagram represents part of a uh, woodland food web. Which statement is true for the organisms in the food web? Okay, so let's have a look at the, the statements. The owl and the stoat are an intraspecific competition. So immediately I'm thinking intraspecific, that means that they are the same species, okay? Are owls and stoats the same species? They are not, so that one's not gonna be true. Uh, the bank vole and the shrew are an interspecific competition, okay? So they are different species, okay? They are different species, so interspecific makes sense, but are they actually in competition? Well, let's have a look. Uh, the, where are we? Here, here we go, the bank vole is here, and the shrew is over here. Now, are they actually competing for a food source? They are not. The shrew eats ladybirds and the bank vole eats beech nuts. So they're not actually in competition, okay? Even though they are different species. C, the ladybird is both a predator and a prey. Well, let's have a look at the ladybird, which is here. So the ladybird is a predator of the green fly and it is also the prey of the shrew. So we think it's gonna be C, but let's just check D is wrong. The green fly is a producer. So we can see the green fly here, but there's an organism below it in the food chain there, so it's not a producer. This is the producer here, the beech leaves. Okay, so that one's gonna be wrong as well. So the answer's gonna be C. Okay, question 20. The graph shows the changes in population size uh, of a predator and a prey over 20 years. The difference in the population sizes of the predator and its prey when each population was at its maximum is Okay, so let's find out where the maximums are. So predator is the solid line. The maximum for the predator is here. And for the prey, the maximum is over here, okay? So the population of the, the prey here is gonna be what, 72,000, okay? 72,000, okay? Because if we look at the scale, it tells us that those numbers are in thousands, okay? And I've read it off here as being 72. For the predator, we can see that's going to be, what, 56? Yep, so that's going to be 56,000. Okay. And all we do is do 72,000, take away 56,000, and hopefully our math is good enough to know that that's going to be 16,000. Even if it's not, you can use a calculator in the exam, so that's fine. All right, so it's going to be B for that one. Hope that helps, folks. I'll see you in the next one.